Before choosing an electric mower, there are a couple of things you need to consider. How big is your garden? How wide a cut do you need for your mower? Do you want to collect grass or do you want to let it lie on the lawn? There are three main types of electric mower. The first is the hover mower. Beautiful little thing. A mini mower like this is perfect for somebody that's maybe a little bit elderly, hasn't got the strength to handle a bigger machine. Perfect for small gardens. It won't collect grass, however, but that's no harm because it cuts the grass very finely and it's perfect for mulching in. This machine has a much more powerful motor. It goes so fast, it mulches the grass as it cuts. It's got a big steel blade in it, so you don't have to worry about gathering up the grass. It will nourish your grass as well. It fertilizes the grass as it cuts. This machine is suitable for a medium-sized garden. It's got a grass collecting facility, big box inside, the grass comes up and is compacted firmly in there, so it collects an awful lot more grass than you might think. Now, all of these machines are height adjustable, so you can control the height of the cut. Hover mowers float on a cushion of air, which is generated by this big fan. This is rotating at a massive speed. This fan creates a pre an air pressure that lifts the mower right off the ground. The height adjusting system is very simple. It is supplied with a spanner and a couple of spacer discs. You might be able to see there is a disc in here already fitted. If you want to get, cut the grass shorter, you simply take off the blade and fit another disc, or maybe two discs. So it'll give you another half inch shorter. However, I recommend that you don't cut your grass too short because it helps to grow moss. The second type of mower we come to is the wheel rotary mower. It's suitable for any type of garden and it's possibly the most commonly used mower there is. Because these mowers are wheeled, it's a very simple matter to adjust the height, particularly with these where a single lever adjustment is required. It's a simple matter of moving the lever backward or forward for higher or lower. This model also has a single lever adjustment. It also has a vision window so that you can see when the grass box is full and needs to be emptied. It also has a mulching facility. You take the grass box off, let the door close down, and the cut grass will help to fertilize your lawn. Wheeled rotary mowers work with a horizontal rotary blade, rotary action. This bend on the blade creates an updraft which draws the cut grass right up into the grass chamber and therefore into the box. The third type of mower we come to is a cylinder mower. Ideal for small gardens, give a perfect cut every time. In fact, you could say a show lawn cut every time. I'll just show you on this one. There's a, two blades. This action is similar to this one here, but I can show you. It operates as a blade underneath and the revolving blade then traps the grass in between and shears it off exactly like the scissors. Perfect cut every time. You also get a really nice striped effect on your garden because of the rear roller. You can also get non-electric hand push mowers which do several jobs for you. They cut the grass, they also help to keep you slim and fit. They give it a terrific cut. They've got the cylinder mower effect, which gives a really, really neat short cut. I don't think there's another thing I can say about them. They're super. Now there's your guide for choosing electric mowers. Don't forget, keep children and pets out of the garden when you're cutting the grass, and don't forget to wear your safety goggles. Now for more helpful hints, go to woodiesdiy.com.